constructing congruent line segments and we're going to cover standard 16 and the objective for this lesson is that you're going to be able to use a compass and ruler to construct a congruent line segment so, but before we begin let's go ahead and take a look at what a compass is and what the, the uh, parts are of a compass okay so you can see here that I have this compass, okay, and on one end I have a pencil, on the other end I have this middle point, which is what we call the compass point. And this compass opens and closes, okay, so that way when I construct something, I can take measurements using this, and I can use my compass point to swing and draw arcs, okay. so. Before we get started here, there's a few things that you're going to have to make sure that you have. First, you need to make sure you have a compass and ruler. Okay, so if you don't have those two things right now, go ahead and pause the video and get them. And then come back and hit play and continue on with the video. Um, if you do, let's go ahead and get started um, with the rest of the worksheet or with the rest of the lesson. So, a congruent line segment are line segments that are equal in length. Okay, so you can see here that I have two different line segments, but each one is 10 centimeters. Okay, because they're both 10 centimeters, they're considered congruent. All right, and this is going to be what we're constructing today. We're going to be taking one line segment and constructing one that is going to be the exact same length as the one that we're given. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look at step one. Step one is you're going to draw a point not on the line and label it point A. Okay, so you can see here that we're given our original line. Okay, so we draw a point that's not on the line and we label it A. Okay, step two, we want to use the compass to measure the line segment. Okay, so I take my compass point and put it on one end open my compass or close my compass until um, that pencil is the same length as my line. Okay, now that I have it, I have my measurement. So I want to use, for step three, I want to use this measurement and place the compass point at point A. And I want to draw a small arc. So I place the compass point at A and I Draw a small arc, okay, and let me go ahead and shade this in in black so you can see this a little bit better. Okay, so there's my arc. So let's go ahead and move on to step four. And in step four, we want to use a ruler to draw a line from point A to the small arc, okay. Now, where we draw the line doesn't matter as long as we draw it straight from the line or from the point to the arc. Okay. For instance, here I'm just going to follow this line that's already given to me on my paper. So I draw it straight over, and I have my congruent segment. I have a line here which we just drew, which is the same length as this line that we were originally given. All right, so this concludes this lesson. If you have any questions, go ahead and ask for assistance before getting started. Um, if you don't, um, go ahead and get started on the worksheet and have fun.